Alright guys, welcome back. We're about to head into Blue Garden. One of the next dust circles. And see what this has for us. We're taking Chloe in. I leveled her up quite a bit. Hopefully we should be able to uh, face whatever is to come. Chloe's animation for those that didn't see it. Alright. Um, I don't know if this is a side dungeon or not. I'm not positive. And what I actually had to do since there's no progress the story option. But we're gonna go through here. Let's see. <laughs> Alright, so I fought my way through. There seems to be an evil presence on this level. Hopefully this is the dust spawner. And we can take him out. I don't know if this is the right area. These might be like s extra... Uh, extra circles that I can hey. go to. Some of them look familiar, but there's something off about them. If you handle these like the usual enemies, I think you might regret it. Yeah, I think these are just like leveling zones, pretty much. Don't let your guard down. All right. Let's Next. take this guy down. Pedal waltz. Dungeon Conquered, Blue Garden. Oh yeah, see, this seems to be like a side thing. I skipped through the whole dungeon because there really isn't anything of interest. It's a side dungeon, pretty much. I mean, can't do much in there. I might not finish the Gluttony Lab, maybe, but the crown means I did it. But there's a question. There's an exclamation point near here. Like, if there's something here. And this is the sixth floor is the middle. Maybe I'm not finished gluttony. I don't know. to it. It's like a dance, you know. You do the steps and you're done. It's too embarrassing to think about it any other way. Hmm? What was that? N nothing Come on, let's get this over with. Everyone's waiting. No, but we're the only ones here. Alright, here we go. I yeah, I'll do my best. I just want to show you guys her talking scene. Mm -hmm. 
more exhausting than the last time. And I drink all that milk, too. Yeah. That explains why you smell so sweet. D don't smell me, you creep. Sorry. Sorry, but at least the star child is stronger than the last. Well, duh. I poured all of my milk power into it. <laughs> I hope this child grows up to be a tall one. I see. So that's what the milk was for. But don't you dare let this child be taller than me. I will not be looked down on by my own star child. <sighs> Serena, please. <laughs> they don't even grow. They're just like ch children forever. Um, it did come out to be stronger though, so I guess her milk power did work. We got a, hu a hunter, which is like the archer. Alright, we can proceed the story. So let's do it. Dojo. Hey. Excuse me. Hey. Yeah, dude. What brings you here? Yeah. I want to join the fencing club. Understood. Very well. Let's begin today's practice. Definitely. Okay. Great. Well done. Our club's training is said to be as intense as that of the aquatics team. But you managed to keep up with our training from your first day. No doubt about it. We haven't had someone as tough as you since Alec joined. Huh? Alex in the Fenton Club too? I recommend it to him. I recommended it to him, since we're both S-ranked. But he doesn't appear to enjoy having the participating group activities. Huh. He doesn't even come by here anymore. <sighs> I see. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to get some dinner with a few classmates. Would you like to join us? There's a great noodle place that I really like. They have the best soba. They need, they need 72 types of herbs into their dough, so it's very healthy. Sure, I love Whoa. Soba. But I have some business to attend to, so I can't go. Oh, sorry. Sorry, thanks for inviting me, though. See you later. I see you then. I'll invite you along the next time, so something comes up. Hmm. I wonder if Fina is still on campus. She's not in her classroom. Hmm? Hmm? Is that Fina over there? Over by the flowers? Oh, sir. Fina. Ah, I finally found you, Fina. I have a special favor to ask of you. Of course. Ask away. Damn. Fina, this isn't enough. I need to keep going. Shouldn't you take a rest? You appear to be quite exhausted. No. I only have two years left as a disciple before my star energy fades. I have to... Get stronger. Very well. I am indebted to you for saving my hometown. The skills that I have mastered over the years, I will teach them to you as quickly as I can. I know this training will be rather rough on you. I apologize in advance. Definitely. Right. I'll take it on. Well then, here goes. Ha! God's gift. What business do you have calling me out to a place like this? Alec. I want to spar with you. One more time. I'd heard that you had joined the fencing club. But if you think that's going to give you the edge over me, you're sorely mistaken. You really think so? There's no knowing that unless I try. I apologize for breaking the rules when we fought in class. That issue with the monster had been weighing heavily on my mind. Miss Chloe pointed that out to me, and I couldn't deny it. I ended up being on bathroom cleaning duty for a week because of that. You can laugh at me for being such a disgrace of an S rank. That's why I want you to give up such foolish desires as revenge. This is not the time to be concerned about such things. That's not true. This isn't about revenge. I just... I need to know how much stronger I've become since then. And do you wish to use me for that purpose? Definitely. That's right. You can refuse if you don't want to. That is a foolish offer. Come, God's gift. Find out what the difference between our strengths truly is. Uh-oh. <laughs> is that as far as you can go, God's gift? Nah, I'm not done yet. This is a waste of time. We can both see that you are at your limits. You are stronger than before, but this is the extent of your true strength. This isn't over. How are you still going? Huh. Uh, I'm fighting to get stronger. No matter what, I will rid this world of monsters. I cannot lose. I will not let my father down. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, yes, it's a draw. You've completed your objective at least. Huh? Huh? 
You used me. And now you've proven that you're stronger than before. No. I was only able to get stronger because of everyone in the fencing club. Fina. And you, Alec. I did nothing. All I am is a murderer. Alec. Alec. I killed someone. And worse, another disciple from this very academy. There's nothing more foolish than that. No. If you hadn't beaten that monster right then, I would have. I know I've said this before, but there wasn't anything else we could have done. If... If one of your friends became a monster, would you be able to slay them? Damn. I... If it's my mission... It's a difficult question. I don't think I would, honestly. I'd probably find a way to cure them. Which would probably make him feel bad that he did. Oh, what do I say? That's a difficult question. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have asked. I don't know what I would do either. Even now, I can't sort out the details of what happened in my head. Damn. Such pain exists only because the dust circles are still here. While I have this brand, I will close them all and stop the monsters from coming out. I'll spare no effort in helping you in that cause. Thank you. Thanks, Alec. Uh, should we shake hands or something? Let's not. <laughs> I don't need a symbolic gesture to prove my word. Same here. Hmm? It's from the research lab. Oh, is Alec with you too? Yes, ma'am. It's rare to see you with a friend, Alec. Two boys all alone in a oh, dark God. place at a time like this. I'm not very good at dealing with her. Will you talk to her for me? <laughs> I can hear you, Alec. You underestimate the capabilities of the Visomatic. <laughs> anyway, I'm sorry to bother you, but I need you at the lab at once. One of the circle seeds has finally activated. Hurry. You should go. If you anger her, there are sure to be serious consequences later. Definitely. Yeah. Tori will be participating in your group oh, cool. as a team member, so play nice with her. I hope to get along with you all. Tori! Same here, Tori. Hmm? Chief Ruby, Miss Beautiful isn't here yet. Fine's gone back to her hometown for the time being. What? Miss Beautiful went back? She was their leader there, so it seems there are still some things to be done. It'll be a while before she can act as a member of the Dusk Spawner Exterminators. Let me tell you about this new labyrinth. The new Dusk Circle is relatively far from both the mainland and this island. We estimate that the circle activated as much as three weeks ago. The labyrinth itself materialized today, and the monsters have begun to escape. The density of the dusk circles is slowly increasing after all. Is that also because of the monsters? I don't like the sound of that. We've been authorized to send a team into the circle. We leave at 10 a.m. tomorrow. I want each of you prepared to enter this labyrinth. Are we clear? Roger that. Understood. All right, so we know where we're going. We can talk scenes with her now. She's, she's like, I gotta get her filled up to these, to the rest of the team. Let's talk to Tori. We'll see how this goes out. And this place is just this. Tori! Tori! Did someone call for me? Yeah, I did. Oh, it's God's gift. Hello, do you need me? I really wanted to Definitely. see you. Hey. We'll be classmating together soon, so I thought I should pay my respects. We both got important parts to play as God's gifts, and God's gift and a disciple. What a proper greeting. Good. I'll be proper too. Let's both you and me play our parts. I'm looking forward to class meeting. Anytime is okay. Thank you. Got it. I'm glad to know you'll be there when I need you. Is that all you needed? Is it okay if I go back to my seat now? I'm going to look out the window now, at the sky. The clouds are calling me. She's a little weird, but I like her hair. <laughs> oh, black and white. but first, I have a question. Do you like the fluffy part of dandelion? Um... I like how they're sure. fluffy. <laughs> okay. Well, I love the fluff. Okay then, goodbye. See ya. Well, hey, goodbye. 
Tori, huh? I get the feeling she's a little eccentric. <laughs> yeah, I get that feeling too. We got her to the happy happy though. That's cool. Let's go do a class meeting with her so we can see her first class meeting reaction. Um, if you guys could, if you know, if you're playing as well, tell me what that is next to Fuko's um, smiley face. It, it looks like, I don't know, two little baby heads. I don't know what that is. Confused. The rest of them don't have it, but she has it for some reason. I don't know what that is. Um, alright. So, a class meeting with you. Also, um, when I went back into the sixth level of the second dungeon, I found a star... Uh, Matroshka, which raises the heroine's mood and gives the newborn a boost in mood and stuff like that. I don't know. It's I guess it's rare. Pretty cool. I think I'm gonna use it on her so we can get a boost to her mood and uh, raise her thing up quicker. So yeah, let's do this. Tori, you up for some class mating? Okay. Huh? Well, that was straightforward. You're sure you want to? Yes. I'm ready. Are you? Yeah. I'm all set. This is my first time class meeting. I'm a little worried about doing it right. I'm all right. Relax. I'll help you through it. Okay. I'll follow your lead. Just show me the steps. Got it. All right. Let's start off just the way we were taught. Okay. If I remember, I'm supposed to reach out to you first. I touch you like this, and then say, Hmm, <laughs> while thinking deeply. Okay. There we go. Touch your heart. <laughs> All right. So, I don't think we ever had a ranger before. I managed to make a hunter with um, with Serena, but we got ranger now out of this. So let's do that. We'll have our first one be a ranger. Ellie the ranger. Boink. There he is. My ranger. Nice to meet you. child in the world. Good job. That's a good thank you. I'll give you one in return. Oh no. It was my pleasure. I didn't know class meeting was so amazing. It took me by surprise. <laughs> I want to see the star children more. So take me to the labyrinth next time. You're right. Sure thing. I'll ask for you by name the next time I go. That's true. You'll really take me with you? No. <laughs> Good. I'm, I didn't mean to lie to Okay. Is this all you needed? Thank you. Yep. Thanks, Tori. I'll be sure to come to, to you again for help. Okay. Goodbye. Yeah. I still have to get nine kids with these new girls and stuff. And, um, update the rest of the old girls' teams. Because, um, they have their nine kids or more, but the, um... They're still like the locked at level one, uh, level 11 kids. And I need to get the ones that go higher. Like, right now, I'm, I'm gonna take Chloe in. Cause I have her nine that go up to 29 in level. So I'm gonna take her. Well, this one's 19, but you know, the rest are all 29. And you know, Fuko and all of them, they have these ones that lock at level 10 and 11 and stuff like that. This one is up to 99. I should actually. Take this one in, so the one that's 19. Like that. There we go. And yeah, so um, where's um hers? It's like a 25, 27 for Otis, the hunter. Yeah, so I mean, as long as it's above 20, then I will be happy. Um, and then I have to start leveling them, of course. 
much. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to do level-wise and stuff. That's why I'm taking Chloe's in because they're already at a good point. They go in first, and then we'll worry about um, the next team when I pick that person. All right, so we're heading to the labyrinth that just opened. This is it here. Greed. Let's do this. To the greed lab. Should be fun. This is the third one. I've taken Narika, Fuko, and now Chloe. Next one I'll take would probably be. I don't know, Ellie or Serena? I kind of want to see Serena. Hey! But we might end up taking Ellie. So the next one. Lucas! Looks like you've made it to the, lab to the labyrinth. Yeah. Yeah. You seem calm today. Is Chief Ruby out today? Hello there. Awesome! I've been officially approved to monitor you in the labyrinth. Sorry. It would be great if I had time to sit in front of that monitor all day, but I don't. If something happens, I'm supposed to contact the chief about it. Thanks. I see. I'll be counting on you. Hm. Good for you, Klotz. You can be my researching buddy. Klotz. What's up, Klotz? <laughs> There's something I wanted to tell you that I couldn't mention with Chief, Ru chief Ruby around. But just to be honest with you, yeah. Mark's research team has already entered that labyrinth before you guys. What the? What? Because this is a new labyrinth, they say they may have... They may make some new discoveries. Sorry. I mean, I was against them going in. Right. But nobody will listen to what an assistant has to say. Huh? So Mark and his team are currently in the labyrinth? Yeah, but it's past their planned return time, but they still haven't come back. Mark's team can't use their star energy, so they can't communicate with us. Seriously? The chief says they're fine and just running late, but I'm worried. Got it. All right. I'll try to see if I can find them while you're in, while we're in here. Thanks. Well, thanks. Just keep that in Mark. mind. Mark. Damn, Mark. How reckless of you. Damn, so Mark's in here. That's gonna be a pain. Why do they want- why do they come in here? They want research. Why don't they just send me? Oh, jeez. That's what I'm here for. To research stuff. And kill off dust spawners, of course, but still, here thank I go. you know, to research stuff. Oh, look at that. It's a rhino uh, monster. Here I go. Tweets on the sides. Pedal stone to the side. Now! Slash. It's our turn. Type 53. Let's do this. I'm gonna clear the room. Okay. So... Is this the right way? Yeah, I'm sure. These, th these monsters spawn really, really fast when you... Uh, pretty crazy. It's funny, I didn't notice this, but I mean, I match like crazy with, uh, with her. Now red and black, red and black, that's our thing. There might be there might be a sign. I'm just saying. There might be a, a sign. <laughs> this seems this seems like a really good dungeon to level on. So I'm definitely going to have to take the rest of uh the hero hero hey heroines. Heroines. Hey de hey got 
The girls in here. Okay. Do, 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 do. I finally found the portal. Next door. I feel like these places are getting bigger and bigger and like harder to maneuver a lot more. Hunter's bow. Cool. I gotta start leveling up a hunter. Since I have one. Okay. Oh yeah, I wanted to grab that. Hopefully I can get it before that one comes and gets me. Active gloves. I gotta go through Rondo too. Let's see. What we have that might be good. Like right as of right now, I'm just equipping the best and doing it best option where it, it, it picks for you and equips the best I'm going to have to go through it but I think it would probably be the best to do that you know you don't get the best out of that if you want some extra stuff on your characters that's all I know Zell Cutter ooh wow that's a new looking sword I'll give it to Eva So let's equip the best on the team. I hope it equips good amount of stuff. Uh, that. Hatch plus. Third floor. Oh, give me that. HP recover. Sure. Why not? Okay. Level three. Probably about halfway there. I'm assuming there's gonna be six levels for this one. Like it was in the other one before this. Right now, Chloe is my highest leveled heroine and has the highest leveled uh, kids. So good for her. Okay. So I definitely won't be using her though after this dungeon. So I can see if I can catch everyone up. Especially since the next dungeon will probably be harder. Which means like, I'd have to get the next girl that I'm using to like 30 or something crazy like that. We're definitely coming back here though. I'm gonna take. I don't know. Whoever I choose, I'm gonna take them here. And we're gonna fight. We just fight and fight and fight and fight. Until we get our levels to the correct amount. No, they really don't hurt us that much. Like, he's take they take like 88 off of our, um, our star children. So, like, it's like 20 plus is like the right level for this dungeon. So, uh, yeah. I think it's a good place to, to, to stop. Definitely. And those uh, those sub dungeons, I'm gonna need to jump into them. Try those out. Um, I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Oh, no, 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 I'm not. No, I'm not. Because we're gonna go to the right. We're going backwards so we can make it back here. And this dude's a pain. I'm going to guard the door, I hate it. Time for the count. And here we go. Let's hope this is the right way. What I got? What I got? Mana stone.
have enemies in this point. Take you out. I swear, I hate these rhino things. Pretty good about that. They take a lot of hits. It's kind of a they don't dish out that much damage, but they do take a lot of hits. Which is crazy. We're on the fourth floor. I didn't even know we were on the fourth floor. We made it pretty far. Far down. No. This is not the right way. And this dude just goes right to the door to guard it from me from leaving. Screw you. Not worth a mana stone. Okay. Dude, Lord. Looks like this is another dead end. Gotta go that way then. Way back in the beginning. Area. Sadly, we're smashed in here by these damn monsters. Oh, we're good. Okay. This way. I swear, though, I'm not lucky at all that. I picked the wrong way. And I have to go all the way back to the beginning area. Go through the other doorway. You know that? Ooh, MP. Take it. Nice. I knew that was there. I wouldn't have used those MP potions I have. Oh no, leave me alone. I don't think he even cared that I appeared at the door. He was going to guard the door so I can't leave. And then basically he'd run into you and then start a fight. Speaking, I think that I goes for that thing. There it is. Oh, this is it. I think powerful presence on this next floor. Gonna be dealing with the dust spawner. Greed's dust spawn spawner. Dust breaker bar. Uh. Hey. Ah! Someone save me! Oh, scientist. Damn it! I am not dying like this. Oh, is that Mark's team? This is bad. I need to let Chief Ruby know at once. Mark, it's you. No. Damn. Damn you monsters. Get away from them. This must be... Seems those guys can use powerful fire spells. Whoa. But they've got poison attacks too, so be careful. <laughs> so these aren't the dust bombers. This is just where Mark managed to get to. Damn it, Mark. Don't let your guard down. This is the thing we fought in the sub -dunk. Next. Right. See how he likes the pedal walls. I think... Right in his face is actually his weak point, too. So. Damn, he's down. <laughs> you can't mess with our power. Alright. These things are a little tricky. Children, I don't think. Yeah. One down. Let's do this. Uh, I guess blood's blowing. Ah! Oh, nice. Is it over? Yeah. We own them. Before they even got a chance to get off an attack. That's what I'm talking about. Power to the children. Whew. You saved us. I was afraid we weren't going to make it for a moment. Why are you doing something so dangerous anyway? We didn't intend to come this deep, but we couldn't help it. This labyrinth is so intriguing. We've been gathering an immense amount of data here. It's filled with monsters that we've never encountered before. Mark! Yo, Klotz. How are you keeping these guys company? I'm just glad you're okay. Mark, are you alright? Yes, we're not hurt at all. Thank you for rescuing Mark and his team. Diving into a labyrinth that just formed is reckless. Mark, it's too dangerous here. You need to get back to the surface ASAP. We'll head back once we've investigated here a little while longer.
Should I get mad about this? I am kind of mad that they're sending these people in here. I mean, what if it happens again, right? Alright, I'm gonna get mad about it. You gotta be kidding me. Sorry, but this is our job. Like the chief said before, we can't just let you disciples head into danger alone. And once we're done, hopefully we'll all be able to investigate more safely. Hmm? Done with what? It's a, well, a special item we're currently developing. It's still a secret, though. Well, we're going to head that way. I'm praying for your success. See you. Everyone at the research lab is pretty much like him. They're worse than children. <laughs> I agree. Even you seem mature compared to them. Huh? What about me? No. Never mind. We're going to resume our investigation. Be careful. Alright, I ran my through I ran I ran my through I ran myself through the fifth floor. So one to six. Seems to be another floor. Hopefully and uh, when we get to the next part, we'll be done. We'll be done here. And we can face our uh, dust spawner boss. I think we're more than ready to face the dust spawner with this team at least. The one uh <laughs> One disciple man, uh, girl managed to get the one level 99. I think it's Chloe actually. So I, if I can, and if I can do that with all of them, I'll be so, so happy. And then we'd have, uh, we won't, I don't have to keep making more. But in this case, we're going to have to. Sorry guys, if you hear barking. Um, my dog is going a little nuts. Oh. Okay. Right here. Go to the right. Please be a portal here. It's here. Yes. Oh man, still going? Yeah, they're getting longer, these dungeons. And harder at that. Seventh floor. There's a lot of greed in the world, unlike um, gluttony, which is kind of true, right? Um, I just hope I'm going the right way, so I can kind of push through. Potion. Mm, of course I'm not. Love when I'm not going the right way. I like the music. I like the beat in the background. Sounds cool. Facing off with these demons. Actually, I'm just funny. Please be in here. Uh, dang it. It's gotta be up ahead. I'm getting closer. Straight, straight hallway, straight corridor into our portal. Yay. Whoa, get out of here with that. Portal. Floor 8. How far do we have to go? I'm gonna explore these places more thoroughly uh, during um, during um, my training here with the rest of the girls. Get whatever I can and uh, look at all the areas and such that are here. As of now, we're just trying to power through. So we'll make it to the end of this 
this day and place. Ah, right. oh, it's a trap! You haven't had any trouble with traps until... Oh my god, what the hell is that? It's a boss thing, apparently, if it's by itself. See if Petalwalt does some damage. Oh, significant amount of damage. It's our nice. turn. Mm -hmm. Take 53. Dropped. Man. Is that all you got? I'm gonna put one thing on this. I'm gonna put one thing on this. Cool. Not a joke, we may be running, but we're on level nice. I thought they were going to make us go to the 10th floor, but here we go, here we go. The spawner time. I'm ready. Me and Chloe, we're going to do this. Oh my gosh, man. Look at that. Never mind. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready. Huh? Is this the dust spawner of this labyrinth? Yeah. Looks like it. But from what I can tell, this must be not only does this one increase its defense, but it makes it harder to perform chains. Don't spend a lot of time on this one. Finish it off as quickly as you can. Mm -hmm. You can slay that monster and you'll be able to sterilize the circle. Of course. Make sure you do your best. <laughs> we will. Now, seal the dust spawner. Let's do this! This monster just looks. This is gonna be a breeze. Let's do this. As Chloe put. <laughs> Here I go. We got this, we got this. Damn, he is crazy looking up. Looks like it's my turn. Alright. I wasn't planning on chaining anyway. I'm just going to try to avoid him as best as we can. Oh my gosh, that's all powerful. Let's do this! Let's get him! We got 
Him. Big guy's down. Yeah. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Let me tell you. Feeling especially pretty good about that. It's really paying off. I'm stronger now. It's a third dust spawner down. There's our ceiling, my trush, my trushka. And All in. right. We, su we successfully sealed the dust spawner. Incredible. Definitely. We'll be returning now. Yay! We did it. We're pro. Pro as heck. The third circle has been pacified as well now. Let me thank you once more for saving us too. <sighs> Can't you at least wait until we sterilize the circles before you go in there? Time won't wait. If we kept postponing our work like that, we'd be the ones paying for it later. Yeah, but you would be the ones paying for it with the death now. Don't worry. The company doesn't think that this is the best situation for us either. Parts that need improving will be improved. We just caught mid-cycle right now. Still, the fruits of our labor are worth putting ourselves in harm's way. That labyrinth has dark crystals of even greater purity. What's that? 80%, hmm? We are now nearing a breakthrough in our development. Yes, it'll be a significant step forward. Hmm? Another reference to your research. I know what they're talking about. But it's top secret, so I'd be skinned alive if I told anyone about it. At the same time, we've gathered some not-so-pleasant data as well. From our comparisons of the three circles we've seen, we've reached a conclusion. The circles that activated later have stronger monsters and dusk energy inside. Uh, obviously. And if it continues at this pace, there's a high probability that another nearby circle seed will become active soon. In other words, the remaining circle seeds will turn into labyrinths in series. <clears throat> the situation has gotten to a point where we can't let our guard down at all. I wish we could at least spend our school lives in peace, though. You seem to be enjoying it a little too much, Klotz. <laughs> That's what Chloe said. Man, even at work, I'm still under my sister's thumb. <laughs> All right. That's the third circle down. 63 kids. I'm aiming for 100, man. I gotta have a new record. Oh, what's going on? Alec. Hmm? Huh? Where's everybody else? I only summoned the gentleman today. Klotz, the fanfare, please. Right. Ahem. <clears throat> Bum ba da ba! The research lab has developed a tool to support class mating. The Metatron. Metatron? Our astounding research has brought something to light. We've discovered the ability to class mate 
two male disciples with what? high star energy. I don't want to do that, huh? Wait a second. Doesn't classmating require a male and a female disciple? He's right. The ritual involves pouring a male's ether into a female's star world. Normally, yes. But with enough study, we have reached a new conclusion. As long as there's a substitute for the star womb, even males can star conceive. This is because male disciples have an enhanced ability to receive ether. That's why we created a machine that will act as an artificial star womb. With this, male disciples should, in theory, be able to perform class meetings as well. But that's... Doesn't that sound great? No. Do you have the church's approval for these developments? The church understands the necessity of creating star children. Is that enough? And then? So why were we summoned here? To be test subjects, of course. We aren't close to completing this project yet. We'll call this variation of class mating. Um, class manting? Class manting. <laughs> the God's Gift, the Academy Top S-Ranked Disciple, and a boy with a genius sister. Those are a fair sampling, wouldn't you say? No! I'll need you to perform it with each other. The more data we can get, the better. No. Class mating with other guys? Is that all right with everyone? I'm an assistant in this research, so I need to see it through. Besides, I was told I was going to get a bonus with my next paycheck. Sure. Oh, God. I see. Well, then. This is weird. Fine. I need to brace myself. You don't have to get all tense. We're just experimenting. So let's relax, okay? Alec. All right. What about you, Alec? To be honest, I'm not comfortable with this. But if it'll help our mission. Sure. Yeah. Do you think <laughs> I can't wait to do this? I want to. I want to. No. <laughs> you think I enjoy this? I hope not. Do you think it's I enjoy this? It's our mission to help find new ways to fight monsters. Be a man and suck it up. Let's get going and prepare for the ritual. Uh, you can go change over there. Don't say sucking it up. Uh, this is weird. I'm not against it, but is everyone I'm ready? just not one. I'm not. I'm not in the. I'm sure you were a little nervous <laughs> since this is new, but I wish you all luck. All right, fine. Let's do it. Class manting. What's going on? No, no. <laughs> that was tougher than I thought it would be. My head hurts. Is that one of the effects of the experiment? Mine too. Could it be because I did something wrong? Well done, everyone. That concludes today's experiment. We couldn't make any star children, but we were able to gather some substantial data. I hope you'll cooperate again no. another time. <laughs> what the? There's gonna be. There's going to be another time. I don't want to. <laughs> Hero's grave. That certainly was different. <laughs> Still, it was kind of fun. You think so? Well, I guess I enjoyed the novelty of it. Definitely. It's because we're all so close to one another that we can do these things. Ever since I lost my hometown to the monsters, I've always been alone. But in coming to the academy, I've been able to find people I could be close to. Klotz! Klotz, I'm talking about you. Right! We're friends and we'll be forever. Mm -hmm. Chapter 4, Seven Witches? Said. Wake up! Alright guys, I'm gonna end it here on the next part where we figure out whose voice this is. See you later. Bye! Try